Welcome back. If you're new, thanks for stopping by. So this is part four of my crawler course build. And today I'm gonna to be working on these two pieces of wood right here. I'm also looking at adding railing to the high parts just so the truck doesn't come falling way down and you don't have to stand right there. And there's something to catch it. Net, rope, uh, railing, something. I have more rocks over here. I should be getting more soon. I'd like to do more than just the rock hill. I do like that a lot, but you know, I got a lot of area here. Uh, but we'll be working on that mostly and figuring out what I'm going to do for the other end of that. So let's get to it. Figured I should update now because that was quite a lot. I also realized I had the camera far away, probably standing in front of the camera a few times. So next time, I'll try to get closer up up here. But here's what I've done so far. We got our next platform here. That is our bridge beams. I'm not sure if the vehicle will go across right now, but it's going to be a pr fairly wide bridge just because. Also, kind of be nice to maybe add some obstacles on it. Then we'll figure out what's happening over here. Nothing down here changed. Got, still got those rocks. Gonna get more. No changes. Probably a couple changes because I was standing on these, so I think I moved some rocks out of the way here. Yeah, that's how that was. So, fix that. And then on here, I added this nice rope railing. That way, if the truck goes to take its spill, hopefully that keeps it from going off the edge and falling down there. I don't mind on here, it's not that high up, but once you get about this high, it's game over. It's gonna break the body or something. And I like that idea so much, starting it over here as well, so. That's our bridge going the other way. So you get up right now. And yeah, got a lot more to do, so 
Let's get back to it and I'll move the camera this time. Just a quick update, running out of daylight, so gonna pick up back tomorrow, but you can see I cut all these out. This is gonna be part of the bridge. Got all the slats here, and you can see it is pretty wide. You can almost fit, well, you can fit two trucks wide. So that was my plan there, but I don't think this is gonna be flat when I get done with it. So just have to keep working, but I'll pick back up tomorrow and we'll work on that. It's the next day, and I definitely forgot to record Got everything here. This is what I built so far. There's our Warren truss. Yeah, I don't have the verticals, but it doesn't really need them. I might build them just so there's some blockage here and the truck can't go out. Or maybe just put something along here. Nothing solid in the center. Still missing supports down here. Only got a few left. I'm going to finish that up. It did take me a while to figure everything out, but I did figure it out. Thankfully not on camera, it would have taken a really long time. Uh, clearing out an area over here, because obviously this has got to go somewhere. Probably multiple places, but we'll talk about that later.
All right, got this finished up for the most part. Well, can't say it's finished. None of these are tied in. They're just kind of placed there for now. So if I want to play with it, truck will probably drive over, no problem. I do need to probably rebuild this platform here, which means I'm gonna have to do some tricks to keep this from collapsing. But I think if I made this a little wider here and then butted it up here, instead of having these extra pieces, it'd be a lot better. That's where we're at with the crawler course build. I uh, don't have a lot more going on. Almost out of daylight again. So we're going to end it here. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, you know where to leave them as well. If you can do the things that are over in this area, I'd really appreciate it. It helps me out. I thank you all for stopping by today. Hope you have a great rest of your day and take care.